I think someday knowing your own genetics is just going to be part of your daily life. Just the way that now people know about their cholesterol levels or their blood pressure. Genetics is just going to be one of those things that's tied to all of us. And we're going to use it to help us make certain decisions or make certain choices in our lives. If we look at linguistic differences between different groups of people and then compare that with the genetic differences, we can understand the evolution of language. The discoveries we make by studying people with European ancestry help us understand the biology underlying certain traits and conditions. But if we study a diverse set of people from around the world, we can really dive more deeply into that biology and understand even more. And we've learned a lot about, for instance, the digestion of milk from studying people around the world and understanding the DNA basis for how they digest milk. Genetics is a very quantitative way of making inferences about uh, evolution and it's also the only tool we have to make any kind of inference about this very distant past. Many of our customers are very interested in genealogy, uh, mainly I think because uh, they want to know where their ancestors were from, which part of Europe or maybe which part of Africa, which part of East Asia. But then also I think that even if you're not interested in genealogy, then it's very important to know about your uh, ethnicity because some diseases have different prevalence in different populations. Just to take an example, type 2 diabetes or breast cancer can have very different prevalences in different populations. Research is a huge part of our mission here at 23andMe. We feel that it's really important to help people understand where they came from, why they are the way they are, and what may be in store for them in the future.